This is the Morning Swim Show Streamline for Thursday, August 26, 2010, brought to you by SwimOutlet.com, the web's most popular swim shop. FINA has released the names of four athletes suspended for doping violations recently. Perhaps the most recognizable name on the list is Australian distance swimmer Ryan Napoleon, who has been given a three-month suspension for unknowingly taking a banned substance as part of his normal routine. The medication Napoleon had been taking was wrongly labeled by a pharmacist, the FINA panel ruled. This means Napoleon will not be able to participate in the Commonwealth Games in October. Napoleon had competed in the Pan Pacific Championships last week, placing ninth in the 1500 freestyle. Other names on the list include Brazilian swimmer Denara de Paula, who got a six-month suspension for taking a banned diuretic. The panel ruled that she did not plan to take the medicine to enhance performance, but still handed her suspension for not fully investigating the types of medications she was taking. Spanish swimmer Sergio Garcia Ortiz was given a one-year suspension for three failures to notify officials of his whereabouts for the purposes of random drug testing. This is a very different ruling than the one given to Rafael Munoz, who had also failed to notify drug officials of his location on more than one occasion. Munoz was only verbally reprimanded and is only on probation until August 2011. And the final athlete on the just released doping list was water polo player Matthew Zamet of Malta, who was out of the sport for two years after testing positive for a banned substance at a competition. The FINA panel ruled that Zamet was negligent in taking unknown pills from a personal trainer. And you can read more about all these athletes at SwimmingWorld.com. The Junior Pan Pacific Championships began today in Hawaii, and Yolan Kukla is going to be a name to watch this weekend. The Australian 14-year-old made the championship final in two events at the Senior Pan Pack meet last week, with her gutsy swim in the 100 fly being her standout swim. This meet has been a breakout competition for a number of stars over the years. At the last Junior Pan Pack meet in January 2009, Dagny Knutson made a big name for herself, as did Elizabeth Pelton and Haley Anderson all of whom made the World Championship team later that year. David Nolan, the national high school record holder in the 200 IM, will swim four events at the meet, and Jasmine Toski, the superstar of this month's Junior Nationals on the women's side, will swim five events. We'll have recaps of each day's competition at SwimmingWorld.com. And that's the news for today. Join us tomorrow on the Morning Swim Show when Mark Schubert will analyze the American team's performance at the Pan Pacific Championships. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on SwimmingWorld.tv.